shit. My body lies over the God! Jesus crap cakes! Duh! Bloody hangovers? Question one. What the fudge cake has happened to my apartment? Question two. Who had the nerve to spill tomato juice in my apartment? Question three. Which arse tard wrecked a 2,000 quid painting? I mean, it's going to take you months to fix up this place. Now, who could have done this? Oh, god damn it, it could be my ex-girlfriend, Lucy. I mean, she's never forgiven me for that time around her parents. I mean, how the hell was I supposed to know her dad hated rock music? And usually people don't feel strongly enough about it to hold a gun to someone's face and start quoting Duke Nukem. You're an inspiration for birth control. Oh! Yeah, although the sensation of Desert Eagle pointing into your mouth isn't exactly enjoyable, I like to think of the Duke Nukem quotes as a bit of consolation. Oh, cool. It's a flying webcam, I think. Hey, I wonder if it'll... Ah! Gah! My retinas! I... Ho holy crap. I... I... What? I... What? I... I don't... What? Crap, man. There's like... There's like nothing on the manual on this. I mean... There's no section that says... That says, oh, I don't know, um, I mean, what to do when your street turns into a war zone, for example? Well, there's dead bodies in my street, evil flying robots trying to take mugshots of me, and my apartment's been made to resemble a, a Georgian charnel house. I'm leaving. Bugging out, that's it. This place is a death zone, and no one's going to stop hey man, me getting out of it. TV? I loaned it to you three I said, ago. no you one's going to... to have it for a day, and you've dodged me ever since. I'm not going to let you go downstairs until you've given it back to me. So go and get it, now! What, so you can watch Breen's submit show? Yeah, that's some real good viewing there. Help me kill the terrorist agitators! Get cookies! Ah oh, well, there must be someone else on this floor that has a TV. I just knew it was going to be one of those days. Thank you, Captain State the Obvious. I don't look into its eyes, don't look into the evil flying robot's eyes! <laughs> Yeah, you better run Cinematron 5. <laughs> anyway, back to Operation Get the Fudge Out. Anyway, let's see which of these are true masterpieces I can flock on eBay. Gah, my kingdom for Terry Pratchett. And who the hell's heard of Jane Austen anyway? I swear I had a girlfriend called that once. Meh, I must have been drunk at the time. Ah, crumpet sacks. I've forgotten completely what I was doing. Right, Brain. I, I don't like you and you don't like me, but here's the plan. I take TV, give it to him, get him done for having stolen property, come back in and steal it late at night, then use it to pay for my new apartment. Deal? Deal. Right, here I go. I'm moving in. Right, anyone around there? Oh, Jesus, it's Janeth! Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Come on, Brain, we had a plan. That's the last time I listened to you. Oh, screw it. That's the bishop set to the netball team. Come on, chums! Well, she hasn't seen me yet. I might just be able to... Must resist urge to rock out. Right, I've got it. Yes! No, I just need to get it unplugged. Oh, monkey balls. Gah! Oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap. God damn it. Is Stephen Hawking working as an electrician now? Jesus Christ. I mean, reported theft? Hell, I know a few officers who'd stick a stun stick up your ass for spitting in a pond. You gave Officer 0654 a funny look. You're going to the pit of souls. Anyway, give the monkey sack his TV so I can get out of here before those Metro Cops start giving me a new brand of electroshock therapy. It's super effective. Whoa. It's broken. You broke my TV. What the hell are you talking Great. about? This TV's well, about as broken as my alcohol addiction. Now, don't you ever ask me for anything again. You got it? Rage. Loser. Rage. 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 TV kick. Rage. Rage! Right, screw you. Screw this building. Screw Janeth. Screw your crappy TVs. And especially, screw your lack of vending machines. You idiots. I hope you all like an interesting new flavour called Hint of Stun Stick. Right, that's it. Come on, Brain. We're bugging out. Hey, man. Can I kind of, uh... uh 
Leave? What if I say, please? Uh, perhaps later then. Well, looks like I'm out of ideas. Whoa, hey, maybe this guy has some ideas. Hell, he looks sane than most people on our block. The then again, I hear he owns a lever rifle and 16 Although pounds of LSD. I, I really don't want to mess with that right now. My and my well, I'm out of options. I mean, I can't be the only one I looking to get out of here. Hey, you got any ideas? Give heed to me and spring thy traps upon mine enemies when I cry out to thee. I came to the conclusion long ago that everyone I live with are assholes. Turn well, it's time for a new plan, I... Hang on! Is that a vending machine? Oh my god, a glass of Dr. Pepper would go down like a Concord right now. Give to me, what give to me, give to me! Let's like go somewhere a little more private. I wasn't talking to you! Like now I... And let all my okay, be call me suspicious, man. But I don't really get worried when strange women start inviting me to their apartment. I have been laid like down in a pit of darkness. I mean, I know I'm in shape, and I'm, you know, I guess I'm reasonably attractive, but still, I mean, this is bordering on the stalkerish. Hey, you know what? It's times like these I realize I really need to rethink my relationship status. Hell, I mean, six dumpies isn't exactly a good track record. Right, lady, I hate to break it to you, but I'm not interested in a relationship right now. I mean, I, I just got dubbed, and oh, raid. oh, you mean you know you're talking about that? You? I totally wasn't thinking what you think I was thinking. I think. I've got some med kits around here Hang somewhere. Hang on, med kits? Eight? Why do I get the feeling this conversation is taking the wrong turn? Argento. He lives on the top floor. He's got a lot of contacts, and if anyone can get you started with the resistance, he can. Whoa, whoa, whoa! The resistance. I hope it all goes well. Well, I mean, you know, I've been, mean, you know, I've been hunting around for a job and all, and and that does kind of remind me of a museum. But still, I mean, whoa, whoa, hey, hey, hey! Stop pushing me, okay? Bloody hell! What's she smoking? That reminds me, I haven't listened to Muse in ages. I mean, they're like the best band in the universe, man. I mean, how can you deny that fact? Matt Bellamy is king of the stage, period. Anyway, before I see this Argento guy, I'm going down to get that Dr. Pepper, and this time, no one's going to stop me. Wait, I've had my iPod in my pocket for the whole time. Oh, hell freaking yes. I'm taking this with me no matter what. There we go. Tell you what, I'm not going to so much just get out of here. I'm going to rock the freak out of here. Oh, yes. With a Dr. Pepper in my hand? Man, this is going to beat jumping the school's barbed wire fence by a long shot. Oh, yes, come to me.